Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here for another quick tutorial. In today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully recover if your Windows 7 computer is stuck on the welcome screen when you're loading your computer. So in order to resolve this issue, we're going to be going through safe mode and we're going to try and troubleshoot the issue. Now, in order to get into safe mode, you're not going to actually need any kind of external media. You just need to power off your computer doing a hard power off three times in a row. So basically, just turn off your power at the switch. So basically, the button you push to turn on your computer, just hold it in for a couple seconds until your screen goes dark. And then you want to get to a Windows error recovery screen. Now you can also get to a screen similar to this through tapping on some of the escape or F2 or F8 keys when your computer's booting up to launch the advanced boot options. That will depend on your computer's manufacturer. That's also another method of how to get to the screen but this is a more surefire way of getting to it pretty straightforward and like I said you can go through the advanced recovery options as well and get to the same options here but we want to get to safe mode with networking so I'm using my arrow keys on my keyboard to navigate down to safe mode networking once I'm highlighted over that I'm going to hit enter on my keyboard and this will begin booting the safe mode interface with the networking capabilities while we really will not be using the network abilities for this tutorial if you are able to get into this utility and we're unable to resolve the issue through the first method I want to show you guys you're more than welcome to go back into safe mode here and try running different antivirus scanners or disk check utilities as well and I've made videos of that nature in the past so I don't want to spend too much time on that but I just thought I would put up a quick video of how to hopefully resolve this issue without too much of a hassle at least from my experience in the past so I just want to put that out there and once we're in safe mode, you want to open up the start menu and you want to type in system restore. One of the best matches should say system restore underneath programs. You want to left click on that. Should say restore system files and settings. Left click on next. If you have any restore points in here, I recommend left clicking on them and then left clicking on next and then select finish. I would recommend also going to the most recently created restore point. And keep in mind once you started the system restore process, you cannot be interrupted or should not be interrupted. So I'm going to select yes here and it will begin the process of restarting our computer and running a restore. So once the restore has finished and we boot it back into Windows, I will be right back. And there we go guys, simple as that. And you can always run a check disk scan and save mode as well, as well as other utilities. And I have made other videos like that in the past. But hopefully this method should be able to work and resolve most of your guys' issues. So as always, thank you for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope I was able to help you out. And I look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.